Hi, I'm Kristen Burt for Red Carpet Report. Tonight we're on the red carpet for the 2019 Performers Nominee Reception. Good. Good. Okay, great. How are you doing? Good, how are you? Good, very good. Good. Obviously, besides your show, what are you most proud about working in television in 2019? Well, I'm really proud about uh, how every studio, um, pretty much every studio and every network, um, we're, they're all trying to push the diversity issue, which I've dealt with my entire career, which is 25 years, and it's really nice to see that everyone is kind of getting on board and, you know, getting a lot of women behind camera, uh, a lot of, you know, women who normally would have maybe aged out, as they used to say, they're in front of the camera, same with men, or even men age out too, and they, and we have, you know, great roles for older men, older women, which is great, because um, I'm getting older. And I'm like, I'm going to need one of them. Um, you look good. Don't worry. Oh, thank you. But um, I really love seeing that. And, you know, for me, I haven't, I've only been directed on, in television by one adult male Latino director in my life. So I haven't really been directed by anybody who looks like me, reminds me of me. So um, I, I'm looking forward to, I'm transitioning and doing more directing behind camera work. So I'm looking forward to, to that, the transition. And, and luckily, what Holly, with, with Hollywood, you know, kind of welcoming diversity with open arms, I, it gives me a better chance than I think I would have had in the past. Is there a particular story you're interested in directing? Yeah, there's a couple actually, um, but there's one in particular. There was a um, there's a there's a man who was um, Latino in Key West, Florida, in the 20s and 30s, and he is the only guy who's ever lynched in Key West by the KKK, and no pe nobody knows that the KKK even existed. So I have the rights to his story from uh, from his family, and so that's a, something we're developing, and I'm I'm planning on directing that. Sounds like an important that's story. Like, yeah, I know that's like good. I understand, yeah. but that that's fascinating too. Exactly. Just uh, people don't know the story, and it does need to be told. Yeah, it's, there's a lot of there are a lot of stories out yeah. there that just <laughs> kind of just no. need to be told, um, and, and, I, and not the we see the same story over and over again, especially with Latino characters. We see, um, you know, there's a lot of narco guys out there. There's a lot of you know. Uh, um, like the sexy Latino who takes the woman from the other guy, whatever. You know, I want to see like you know a story about guys who are struggling in the dating world. You know, I want to see like the, the same stories that everyone else experiences. I want to see that with the Latino. And this story is one. It's like the, this classic historical kind of epic story that with this Latino lead, which is just interesting. Oh, we're looking forward to that. I'm wishing you the best of luck and congratulations. Thank you very much. Take care. Thanks for watching. Be sure to subscribe to this channel, like this video, and in the comments below, let us know who your favorite performance was of 2019.